biggest, I believe it's the big, biggest high school rivalry in the state. I, you could say it's a, it's a hate during the, during the game, after the game, you know. We're all friends again, but during the game, it's, it's most definitely a hate. It's kind of been a quiet week, uh, trash talking wise. It doesn't seem that there's been, at least amongst the players and everything, it seems to have been a little low key. Is that uh, something that uh, you guys have talked about? Yeah, they want us off all social media. You know, not to get into it, not to get bothered with it, just play our game. We talk with our pads. You know, we're gonna do. We're not gonna do the exact same thing because you know they're gonna try to. They're gonna watch. They, I know that they've watched a lot of film on Sunday of last year's tape, trying to figure out what we did to them, shut them down, and they're gonna. So we're gonna have to do some things differently, no doubt about it. But it does uh, give our kids confidence, and our kids are excited, and, and I think uh, they believe in what we do, and I think we're ready. They have a pretty nice offense, but we have a pretty, pretty darn good defense, and uh, like I said, the coach prepared us well this week, and I think the game plan should. I trust them. I really do. I think we're really gonna win this one sense of urgency, especially uh, knowing uh, you guys most likely have to win to get in? Oh yeah, I, I'm ready to play. If we could play right now, I'm ready to play now. I, I'm sure all my teammates are. We've been, we've been waiting for this we've been waiting for this day since last the last win last week. So I mean, we're ready. Anytime you got your crosstown rival wanting to come in and try to scrape to get in the playoffs and you got a chance to end it, uh, you really want to take advantage of that. For bragging rights in the future, and you know, most of us seniors, that's I mean, that's our last game to play our crosstown rival. But uh, mostly as leaders, we've been talking about taking it one game at a time, and uh, it just happened to be West Week. And now we got to bust our behind out here Monday through Thursday and get out there on Friday. One of the better defensive lines that we've seen since way back in the Fort Dorchester game, um, you know, defensively they got a lot of speed and uh, uh, they should match up pretty well with us. Um, offensively, you know, they've kind of, you know, the last two weeks they've bounced back and forth with two different quarterbacks and I'm sure we'll probably see both of them. Uh, we just got to be prepared to, to play our best. Got to be most fundamentally sound up front. Uh, got to be, I got to have better decision making, qu quicker decision making, and uh, uh, we just got to come to play on Friday. Uh, I know, I'm pretty sure we'll see a lot of different looks, different stunts, blitzes, everything to try to throw us off, but uh, we've been working a great deal at a lot of it, and I believe we'll, we'll pick it up pretty well.